The build we're doing right now freaks me out. In the late 70s, early 80s, Toyota partnered up with a company called Chinook to build one of the coolest little campers that was on the market at the time. And some of the crazy thinkers in the marketing department thought, how cool would it be to do a version of that same vehicle, but do it today? It'll be off-road style. We're starting with a TRD Sport Tacoma with a manual transmission. You've heard of tiny houses. This will probably be more like a micro house. We've had some renderings drawn. We're starting to work on some of the engineering drawings and what it's gonna take and how many people we can actually fit into it. That being the sleeping quarter above the cab. Uh, guy standing at the sink there. Guy sitting on the toilet there. And there's your table. Once we get the material here and start building it, do you think you'll build it in sections? I feel pretty confident in building the floor up to the mid rail. And then from up there, we can kind of build everything off the table. We really didn't want it to look like a refrigerator on the back of a truck, so you'll see that there is curve. It's all rounded edges. We want everything rounded. We want to eliminate as much of the approach angle so when we're doing an off-road type of situation, you're not dragging the tail. We're looking at a really cool color scheme that is reminiscent, and I won't go much further than that because that's all to be determined. Some of the big challenges are gonna be just having to shrink everything. Motorhomes are built to be able to hold someone six foot two to walk nose to tail in this vehicle, um, be able to cook, there's room for a couch spread out. We are so space limited that finding things that we can package inside of there is gonna be a challenge on its own. Another really cool thing about this vehicle is it's gonna be a beast. I mean. People are gonna know when you show up. Whether you're hitting the uh, grocery store on your way out of town, it's gonna stick up four feet above any other vehicle in that parking lot. Should be no problem finding your car. Don't have to worry about where you parked it because as soon as you walk out the door, you'll see it. I just hope that I can be half as cool as the original Chinook was. I know it'll be more modern. I know there'll be more technology in it, but we'll see. Being around racing my whole life, race cars are cool looking. I want campers to be cool looking too.